Between Claire's boobs and Jamie's awkwardness, I think I need a drink as well. <laughs> I think I do too. <laughs> they are pretty awesome. <laughs> nah, whenever, you know, there was a little break, I may have had a little uh, stiff one. Um, but no, I think, you know, we had built a... <laughs> Did you really say that? No. <laughs> <laughs> Um, uh, yeah, I think at that point we had become such good friends and, you know, we had Anna Forrester who was fantastic and, you know, the, the episode was written by Anne, uh, Anne Kenny. So we just had this amazing, I still can't get past what you said. She's blushing. Yeah, so we, I mean, we did, we worked on the scenes together and we rehearsed them and then blocked them out and then had a strong drink. And uh, yeah, I think. I think that's what they thought, right? They thought he was hot. Yeah. I knew he was hot, though, so, you know, I already knew that. You're, you're pretty hot, too. Yes, you just have silence. <laughs> Sam, it's Deafening. never silence. <laughs> I know, tell me about it. Share a trailer with you. That's how you eat your honeypot as well, isn't it? Like, it's just your, your fingers or your tongue. I don't know. Like, I mean, they get sticky, don't they? But totes normal. Tote. Totes normal. What have you learned from each other about your craft? <laughs> <laughs> if I could count the amount of times Sam has hit me on the head. Um, <laughs> yeah. You can hear us measured by the side of the sword. <laughs> Obviously, actually, do you know what? One of the fun things, even though I absolutely dreaded it, was uh, turtle soup. Just because it's kind of ridiculous and fun to do something drunk. And Sam sort of was telling me that it was a little too close to home. <laughs> He's seen me after a few drinks. Um, but no, uh, it was... Just to each other. Oh yeah, we do a lot of moaning to each other. Um...